Hey, what's going on everybody? It's about that time for me to do another reverse engineering project 24 monthly update. This is going to be month five. I've got a bit of news money wise. I'm starting to make a little more money. I'm also getting a, a lot more page views than I was last month. It's it's actually pretty cool to see the growth. And also Amazon canceled my account due to uh, me violating some of their terms. So I'm gonna have to fix that and I wanted to talk a little bit about that in this video. I'm gonna cover how many posts I have written, how many page views I have over the last 28 days, how much money I've made off of Azoic ads and Amazon. And I'm also gonna talk about an issue that I recently had with Amazon and how that's going. So if you're interested in knowing how I'm doing reverse engineering project 24, stick around and watch this video. And for those of you that don't know me, I'm Dorian. I talk about how I became a self-taught programmer and you know side hustles such as my first niche website and things like that. So if that's something that you're interested in, make sure to subscribe to my channel and give this video a like to help me out with the YouTube algorithm. All right, let's get going. So let me just start off with the basics on how many page views I've gotten this month and where, where the site is sitting at and traffic and whatnot. Uh, I'm pretty stoked because I'm getting to see some of the data now and since more people are visiting the site, uh, I, I can see kind of what pages people are going to and what people are landing on and all kinds of cool information that I've been nerding out over. I'm going to spare all those details and I'm kind of just going to just show the high level stuff, but this is what's pretty awesome. So right here, you can see this was Saturday, June 6th, I had 361 monthly users now that number is up to 976 that is some pretty nice growth i i i'm pretty excited to to see how many more page views i'm getting now this is just the last seven days here's some of my top top pages that are are getting more page views i'm already i already have a few that are are breaking 100 and I have a couple others that look like they're on their way to breaking 100 page views, so I'm pretty excited about that. I wasn't expecting to make any money at this point, but luckily since Ezoic did uh, let me start putting ads on there early, I, I have been making a little bit of money. I'll get to that in a second. Let me just show you how many page views I've had over, over the month. So here you can see it's from June 6th, to July 5th, I've got 1,252 page views, uh, 1,161, which are unique. I'm super excited to see that many page views. I can see that it's starting to grow. I can see that I'm starting to get more and more traffic. And you know, almost all of this traffic is all from organic traffic. I have, you know, I have not been keeping up with any of the social media. I have not been doing anything else except for sharing my page that one time to a site that, you know, shares links for my niche topic. Other than that, I've set up a few Pinterest posts that, you know, I threw on there and I think maybe there's 10 to 15 of them. I don't even know which, which articles they're linked to because I did it such a long time ago. I should get in there and do that, but I've been busy with YouTube and with work and just with life in general. So things have been slowing down a bit for me on, on this website. I have articles that I've been editing. I've gotten 80 posts done and finished. I had some of my writers fix some posts that I had other people write that still needed a little touching up. So I handed it off to my two writers that I have been working with and I've kept throughout all this and I plan to continue giving work to as soon as I get some more articles, which I am planning to push to a hundred posts here in probably the next three months, I'm going to hit it hard and just take a couple weekends to, to, you know, edit out some of the posts that I have written and just get it all done and try to hit a hundred because that was my goal. I wanted to hit a hundred posts before the six month mark. And I don't really think that's going to happen. I don't want to dedicate this next month to just trying to crank out all those posts. Now I feel that with 80 posts, that's pretty solid. And if I just keep releasing about a post every week or two, that's not too bad. And then again, I'm outsourcing all the writers on this because I just, I don't have time to write any of this. I'm happy to see some traffic, but I'm a long ways away from making back my return of investment but it's a start. I'm pretty excited to see some money here. I'm making some ad revenue on Ezoic. 
as I'm hitting more page views, I'm getting more ad revenue. So that's really cool to see some money coming in there. Six months is supposed to be the pizza day mark. I've made my first $5 in the first four months. I had double the post that was recommended by Jim and Ricky. Again, I am reverse engineering this. I'm not actually following Project 24. So this is just me trying to do whatever I can with all the free material that they put out there. Kind of my own little experiment. It it's, looks like it's gonna end up costing me a lot of money, but hopefully it ends up making me some money. And I can't show the Amazon stuff because they closed my account and I need to fix all the issues that they mentioned that I had with trademarking before I can reapply. It was an honest mistake. I, I just didn't realize that I was doing something that I wasn't supposed to because I'm new to this. And they said that I can, you know, reapply as soon as I take care of the issues. And I'm not super stressed. The money that I was making on Amazon wasn't crazy, but I was starting to see more sales and I hit the amount of minimum sales to keep my account open. So it kind of sucks that this happened. I'm going to go in and fix it probably this week and just get it all sorted out and make sure that that's good. And once that happens, then I'm hoping to make a couple books off of Amazon every month with Ezoic and Amazon and my page views steadily seeming to increase. Um, I'm pretty excited because I can see that, that with more page views, I'm making more ad revenue. So next month, hopefully I make like 10 to 15 bucks just on ads. I, if I keep going in the direction I'm going, and if page views keep increasing how they have been, I, I think I'm going to, I'm probably going to hit that at, at least $10. I'm definitely on track for that. So hopefully next month I make, you know, 10 to 15 bucks on ad revenue and get all the stuff ironed out with Amazon and make a few sales off of that and hopefully hit 20 bucks next month. I'm really, really hoping that that's the number that I hit for next month. And obviously I can't slack on the Amazon thing and I need to get that taken care of sooner than later so that that does happen. But that's pretty much it. I just wanted to make this quick, short and sweet. I don't wanna to get too into it. Just wanna show the numbers over the last 28 days. I'm trying to make sure that I release one of these videos once a month to you know just track the progress on this site. But I'm super excited. This is my first niche site. I've, I've never created a blog before, completely brand new, first time ever. And it's it's cool to see these numbers. So if anyone's out there and they're thinking about buying Project 24 and they don't know where to start, honestly, a lot of the technical stuff I knew that I would understand. So that was, that's a big hurdle for a lot of people. So if you don't understand that stuff, I know they explain it in their stuff. You can also just look for YouTube videos to show you how to set up a WordPress site. There's a lot of free stuff out there that you can, you can reverse engineer Project 24 if you tried. And that's just what I'm trying to do. Jim and Ricky have so much free stuff out there. I. I would buy it, but I'm just cheap. If you've got the money and you really want to make the investment, I really think that this this method works. I think that these guys are onto something. I'm seeing I'm seeing the numbers and I'm seeing that I'm making a little bit of money. I put in a lot of money. I'm in about six thousand bucks, so I've got a lot of catching up to do. I'm not planning on putting too much more money into this. The bulk of the articles are written. I just need to write weekly or bi-weekly articles from here on out. So I'm not. I'm not going to be putting in as much money as I did, but that initial investment was was pretty large. You know, five five thousand bucks, six thousand bucks. That's that's a lot of money. So hopefully, hopefully it pays off. I'm definitely considering making another site, but I have the YouTube channel going, and I'm just so busy. I don't want to try to make another site yet. I'm hoping to maybe turn this into an authority site. I want to see how it does once all these articles rank, and see how many page views I'm actually getting, and see how my articles are doing before I consider dumping more money into this site or starting a second one. And I kind of doubled up on the articles at the beginning because I wanted to see if maybe more was better. And now I'm just kind of letting the dust settle and seeing what happens as these, these articles start to rank and I'm starting to get more organic traffic. I just kind of want to, you know, play it by ear and see how it goes for the next month or two before I make that big commitment of starting another site and getting a bunch of articles written. I, I want to see if I can just kind of maintain this site a bit and, you know, clean it up a little and get it really, really producing well before I go and I jump in and make another website with, you know, with all the stuff I've got going on right now. So if you've been watching these videos, thank you. Uh, again, my channel is mostly about me talking about how I learned how to code and became a self-taught programmer. So these videos I felt were still kind of in line with, with some of that web development stuff since it does involve, you know, building WordPress sites and, and whatnot. And if you saw my video about don't learn WordPress and you're doing project 24 stuff that wasn't applying to you guys, obviously if you're building 
blogs and niche websites, WordPress is a great tool. That was more for people who are trying to learn web development and become coders that that, that applied to. If something really cool happens, I'll upload a video, but if nothing happens and the site just keeps steadily growing, I'm definitely gonna try to keep up the one month updates so everyone can follow along with my progress on my niche site. And make sure to give this video a like, subscribe to my channel if you wanna, you know, follow along with side hustles such as me building niche websites or you know having some motivation on trying to learn how to code uh that's enough of me talking thanks for watching and i'll see you around <laughs>